In my life, I've seen um, what war looks like. I've seen what famine looks like. I've seen what war crimes look like. I've seen what genocide looks like. I've seen what uh, epidemic disease looks like. I know that we're capable of that, of all of those things. And I also know that we're capable of so much more. And so it's a choice. What am I going to do? Am I going to accept that? Or am I going to work for this? And I've made my choice. In a small hamlet of houses some 40 kilometers away from the main hospital in Zomba, I talked to a woman who had AIDS and tuberculosis and who unsurprisingly wanted to live. Her name was Charity and she had two children. As we talked, three other women gathered and within minutes, a clutch of more than 21 smiling and giggling children also collected around us. Each of these children were orphans. One third of the children in that small village were orphaned because of AIDS. James Robinski is the co-founder and chair of the board of directors of Dignitas International, which is a medical humanitarian organization which works to increase access to life-saving treatment and prevention in areas overwhelmed by HIV AIDS. He was also president of the International Council of Doctors Without Borders at the time when the organization received the Nobel Peace Prize in 1999.